Hey y'all, it's your girl Simona. Welcome back to my channel. If y'all can see by the title, today is another story time. So before we get into this video, y'all already know what to do. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Give a girl a thumbs up. Comment down below. Don't forget to follow me on all my socials. Instagram at Viva La Yoshi. TikTok and Twitter at Life with Simone. And let's get straight into this story. So y'all, I ain't talked about y'all girl Kiera in a minute. But y'all, this, this, I was, when I was talking about it, I don't know. I just ain't talked about it in a minute. And this story, I don't know why it just came to my memory. So I was like, let me tell y'all. So y'all already know, remember when I told y'all I was dealing with Kiara, I was hanging out with her all the time. Remember I told y'all because we didn't live too far from each other and stuff like that. And plus neither one of us had a life obviously because we had enough time to hang out all the time. So anyway, one day she kept telling me about this girl. She was like, oh, I need to hang out with this girl. Like I need to hang out with my friend, like my friend, my friend, my friend. So I pretty much kind of, well, not knew all her friends, but like sort of kind of because she didn't really have, well, she did have friends, but like me and her hung out all the time. So it was like yeah so she ended up telling me like she kept mentioning this girl she was like she always be saying like me and her look lit and like me and Kier be looking lit and that she want to hang out with us and stuff like that so she was just like you want to hang so one day i'm at her house she was like you want to hang out with my friend so i was all like okay we can hang out if you want to she was like yeah she be telling me like we always look lit so she want to link with us one day or whatever so i was like okay yeah like i'm not tripping so back then, like now when somebody said they want to hang out, it's like, let's plan it. Back then it was just like, okay, what you doing now? <laughs> like, that's really how it would be. So she like, all right, we could hang out with her or whatever. So she ended up hitting her up and the girl hit her back. Out. <laughs> mm. So the girl ended up hitting her back and she was telling her like, basically like she with me, like what she doing today and all this stuff, such and such, such. So the girl was just like, nothing like, let's get in traffic or whatever. Y'all, mind y'all, I already know at this time I didn't have a car and neither did Kiera. So the girl was like, she got a car, she gonna pull up on us or whatever. So... We waiting around for her to come pull up. She ended up getting there. And when she got there, we walked. Like, here, got in the front seat. I get in the back. And we like, hi. And the girl was like, hi, Simone. So I look. I'm like, who is that? Like, <laughs> wait, what? So I look. And we just going to give her a name. Her name just going to be Nisi. It's not her name. Nowhere near her name. So I look. And I'm like, Nisi? And she was just like, yeah, what's up, girl? My job. I don't. I knew her. Like, I hung out with this girl twice before with one of my friends that, yeah, I gotta speak up, but I hung, I hung out with her twice before with her, and when I tell you, it was just weird when I realized this is the person who been saying she wanna hang out with us, like, it was just kind of weird, because it was like, the first time we linked with her, I linked with her, it was cool, second time it was I, energy was kind of weird, she gave off one of them girls who felt like I'm bougie, I'm better than everybody, but it wasn't giving at her, her lifestyle wasn't giving what she felt like she, like it was i don't know it was just weird like you know how like some females y'all get around dudes because that's how it would be the two times we linked like with the other friend it's like you get around dudes and she'd be kind of weird but i thought maybe i was just tripping i don't know where they just try to say weird random shit like oh i remember when my big bank account fell off my head because it's so big and it'd be like didn't it oh girl just buy you some anyway i don't know but i don't know it'd just be weird another thing about it too like her energy kind of i mean her energy was okay to me but it was kind of like weird like kind of standoffish but then again i was thinking like maybe she was shy or maybe she wanted people who don't like to share her friends because like i said we knew each other we was hanging out through a mutual friend and her and that girl used to hang out like on a daily and me and that girl just started like kind of kicking it again so i'm thinking like maybe it could have been that you know how some girls be like i don't like sharing my friends type thing so i'm like maybe that could have been it but who who knows either way it go i was just like whatever and then another thing why it was weird too is because because after we had hung out like the first time was kind of coolish or whatever like i said i tried to follow her on instagram because the girl she would view my snaps i like i'll see her in my views and shit so i tried to follow her on instagram and the bitch would never follow me back and i just thought that was very weird because it's like why are you in my views but when i follow you, you don't follow me back and she used to do that shit a lot like it was so fucking weird so anyway it was just kind of like strange to me that this was the girl and it's been like some months since I've seen her, but whatever. I'm like, I guess, whatever. So anyway, when we get in the car, they say hi to each other. And they was like, she was like, let's get in traffic. Like, let's go pull up on some niggas. She was like, I want to go pull up on my boo or whatever. He ain't answering the phone. She was like, yeah, his homies, like, he be with ninjas, like, all this stuff like that. So she was like, y'all trying to pull up on him? So we like, all right, cool, whatever. So we ended up, like, well, she calling him. He ain't answering or whatever. So she was like, she finna go to his hood to see if she could find him. So we ended up pulling up to Shells on Sloss. And if you know, you know back then. I don't know how things is nowadays but like around that time if you know you know so we ended up pulling up over there or whatever and y'all already know they outside the niggas outside so anyway we get out the car she's like come on let's get out the car like i mean there's a lot of people there but you could see if she seen her man she didn't see him so we get outside like we got the car or whatever and she like 
doing her one two like talking to everybody or whatever like that and we just me and Kiera like Kiera seen somebody she knew because she had talked to a dude that was from over there but he wasn't right there or whatever so she's seen people she knew or whatever I don't really know nobody like that so I'm just there so this boy ended up trying to talk to me or whatever and it was he was with this other boy and they was to like walked up together like the other boy tried to talk to Kiera and the boy tried to talk to me so mind y'all Nisi over there talking to whoever the fuck she talking to so he talking to me or whatever we just like small talking he asking my name you know asl age sex location no i'm just kidding but he asking me all this shit like we just go back and forth laughing joking talking he like okay i'll never see you around here bah, 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 bah. Chuka, bah, bah, bah. and i'm like i ain't never seen you before me but like how old is you like i'm just saying let me stop but we talking or whatever and next thing you know nisi ended up walking up over there so she ended up asking him she was like where is such and such her dude don't need no name but he do come up later in life so never mind because i was literally finna call this man his hood name so let me not just not give him no name because i can't think of shit right now so yeah so she like where he at or whatever so the boys we talked to they like well no they like we don't know where that nigga at. like we ain't seen him like he was here earlier but he left like we don't know where he at so she like he not answering like he probably would have be like a a female i'm not trying to cuss too much so they like they like man we don't know like stop asking us like we not babysitting that nigga we don't know where he at so next thing you know the boy give us to talking to me or whatever he like so yeah like i'm trying to get to know you better like i'm trying to pull up on you where you live at i be game banging though i'm a hustler can i pull up no i'm just he but basically so i'm telling him where i live so he like oh that's the such and such oh okay they be big kicking it over there on your street i'm like no it's cool over there where i'm at you can pull up every time you want to so then yeah, we talking <laughs> next thing you know nisi like uh-uh no no y'all not finna do this so he like what and she was like no you're not finna talk to my homegirl like you're not finna talk to her so he like man nisi shut the fuck up like he just kept talking to me again he's like yeah but like put your number in my phone so i'm like all right so i'm putting my number in his phone so she like no uh uh girl don't talk to him no you don't need to talk to him so i'm like wait why well, i don't need to talk to him like well he got a girlfriend or something so he like i ain't got no fucking girlfriend she like no but still like you don't need to talk to him or whatever dang should we give him a name nah if i do another story time on him i'll give him a name and i'll just mention him because right now in the way my i ain't came up with the name previously i'm in a call these people by they real they real shit and i ain't trying to do that so yeah so she like no you don't need to talk to him so i'm like still putting my number in his phone because girl you said he ain't got a girlfriend so um what is it he got 20 kids because 21 is my limit so i was just <laughs> so i'm like hmm she ain't said why. So she like, no, you don't need to talk to him. It's like, let me know. The nigga got the package or something? Because if, if so, like, you know, like, I mean, you can tell me that on the low. Like, you, but let me know. Let me know if it's some reason. So she like, you don't need to talk to him. Uh-uh, you don't need to talk to him. You're not finna talk to her. You're not finna talk to her. And she's standing in front of him like this. Like, you're not finna talk to her. Mm-mm, you're not finna talk to her. And then she putting her hands on her hips and doing the most. Like, you're not finna talk. And all up in his face. So he like, Nisi, get the fuck out of my face. Like, the way he looked at her was like, what the fuck is you doing? Like, you know when somebody doing something out the usual? That's what it seemed. Like, it was like, girl, what the hell wrong with you? So when I'm passing him back his phone, because I was slick finna go through it, I ain't finna lie. <laughs> the way she was acting, I was literally while she distracted him. I'm like, oh, okay, we double teaming. I was slick finna go through his shit. I kind of like put my number, saved him, was like swiping up to see what he was on. The app's like, I'm gonna go through this nigga phone. <laughs> I seem weird, but I'm like, I don't know. So anyway, I, um, I'm passing him back his phone. Tell me why this bitch Nisi's gonna snatch his phone like me not for me though because i'm passing it to him it's already damn near his hand she snatched that shit and she's like i'm gonna delete her number out your phone no you're not gonna talk to her mm -mm, y'all not gonna talk no hell no uh-uh she just laughing so he like nisi cuz you being weird as fuck like get my fucking phone so she deletes she's like hold on she really deleted the number and she's like here your phone back and she gave it to him and the way she was just looking at him it was giving fucked before like they just they did it and i'm like Nisi, what's up with you? But I ain't saying that. So I'm, just, so I'm like, you must got a wife or something. He like, man, Nisi, no, I ain't got none of that shit. Like, she know I'm a young fly nigga out here getting money. I don't know why she being weird. So she like, no, y'all not finna talk. Mind y'all, Kiara giving old boy her number. You not doing all that to Kiara? Like, girl, what's up with you? What's up with you? So I'm just thinking like, mm -mm, why is Kiara acting like this? Why is Nisi acting like this? So anyway, so she was like, all right, we finna go. Like, we finna go because such and such, like, her dude not over there. She's like, we finna go. I'm finna look for this nigga. They like, man, da da da, you know, just talking shit to her or whatever. So he was like, man, take my number down because she being weird as fuck. So I was like, all right, what's your number? So while I'm taking his number down, why this bitch over here, ah, ah, like, while he saying his number, like, fo, 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 ah, she, ah, 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 like, she being loud so that, 
like I can't hear the numbers so then um she's just doing the most so one of the boys that she was talking to he ended up saying something to her like he like man stop and he like put his arm around her and like walked her away she's like uh-uh so I'm like what's your number like I put it gave him my phone like put your number in there so he gave me his number so I'm like um you better not prove her right like you know why we shouldn't be talking like let me find out and he just like nah i don't know what's up with her like for real i'm gonna change your life you know niggas try to say that like they're gonna change your life whole time they just gonna waste your time and he'd be like mm, why'd you tell me that so anyway we end up getting in the car and we leaving so she was like y'all i'm hungry y'all want some wendy's or whatever so i'm like cool so i'm like girl why i shouldn't talk to him y'all tell me why when i said this shit this shit th this shit bitch <laughs> No, that's what she was. Tell me why when I asked that shit, why she turned the music up on me? And she was just like, da, 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 ba, ba, ba. I'm just kidding. I forget what she was listening to. But she turned that shit up. She throwing up this nigga hood. And she just driving, trying to swerve out of lane. I'm just thinking like, oh, the bitch was weird last time in front of niggas. Which I'll tell you. That's a whole other story. But I'm thinking like, oh, she's still weird. She's still weird? Because, bitch, what's wrong with you? So I'm just like, whatever. I'm not really tripping. I text the boy like, this Simone Stormy, big daddy. I'm just kidding. I ain't called a nigga that. But I'm like, this Simone Stormy or whatever. So we end up going up. To, we um While we in the car, mind y'all, when we in the car, after her song went off and she ignored the fuck out of me because I'm not going to ask you again, you weirdo. So, um... Her and Kiera's talking, and I'm peeping that conversation, because mind you, Kiera was telling me, I don't know if I forgot to mention this, but when Kiera was telling me how her friend went to hang out with us, Kiera was telling me this was her friend from high school, right? So, while they talking, Nisi was just like, yeah, like, you, like, y'all really, like, you be cool as fuck or whatever, like, y'all really be cool. She's like, it's crazy how we never crossed paths before. So, I'm thinking, like, never crossed paths before out of high school? And then, Kiera was like, Kiera said that shit. Kiara gonna say, can y'all believe what the fuck Kiara gonna say to Nisi? Kiara gonna say, it's crazy how we never met before. We know so many of the same people. And if that sounds so familiar, it's because she said the same shit to me. I'm thinking like, Kiara, you told me this. This your line? And at this point, I'm thinking in my head like, Kiara, you're kind of strange because why lie make it seem like you knew this bitch from high school? Let me stop cussing so much. But why lie make it seem like you knew this girl from, this woman from high school when you met her off Instagram? You met me off Instagram, so it's like big whoop, like... I wouldn't have judged you for meeting somebody else off Instagram when you met me off Instagram. Like, it's not that deep. So, anyway, so she was just like, yeah, so I'm sitting here like, this girl is a liar. Noted. But anyway, so we end up pulling up to Wendy's. When we get to Wendy's, we in the line. It's like a few cars in front of us. Tell me why. Kiara going to text me and was like, hey, can you please pay for my food with yours? I forgot my money at home. So, I'm like, it's cool. I got you. So... After I text her that, she like she's still talking, her and Nisi talking and stuff, because I'm kind of not even saying it, I'm thinking like, Nisi kind of weird, but I'm in my phone. Anyway, so they talking, so Kira ended up texting me back and was just like, yeah, but can you like keep it between me and you that you paying for my food? Because she was like, I just want to keep it between us. So I'm like, yeah, that's cool, because what I was going to say, I paid for Kiara's food. Like, I wasn't going to do that. Like, I was going to pass my money or my card up when we got to paying, like, you know, like whatever. So then, um, next thing you know, she texts me again and she like, yeah, cause it's my first time linking with her. You know how bitches be, lol. I, I don't know her too well yet, so I don't know if she gonna try to go back and tell bitches I'm broke. Girl, I said okay. Like, why is you? You're being weird now because why is you texting me talking shit about this girl when you sitting here in her passenger seat having a full conversation with her? I'm just like, okay. Like I said, okay. So anyway, we pull up. They ask what we want. Four for four. Four for four. Y'all ever seen that thing where they pull up and it was like you pull up to Wendy's and you just scream four for four. But now they're like, it's not four for four no more. It's four for six hundred. But anyway, I still go. But anyway, so. We get our food or whatever. She asked if we could do it in two separate orders. She was like, oh, y'all want to do three? The lady was like, we can only do two anyway, which was perfect for Kira because I was paying for her food anyway. So it's like, yeah. So she's like, yeah, we could do it in two. Her was like, Simone, how you paying? So I'm like, I'm going to pay with my card or whatever. So she's like, okay, just put me and Simone's together. And she was like, because um, Simone paying with a card. And she was like, and Simone, plus you already still owe me money from the other day. I'm thinking like, <laughs> y'all, this was like, I'm just so confused because it was like, Kiara, you're weird. Like, wh why make it seem like if if I owe you money? Like, I literally, you could have literally been like, oh, I'm going to give you cash. You're paying with your card or something like that. Like, why make it seem like I owe you some money, bitch? I don't owe you nothing. Nothing. Anyway, so, I ain't even saying nothing back. I'm just thinking like, this girl weird. whole time I'm texting this man from the gas station. So, we end up getting our food or whatever. And she was like, she going to park. So, Nisi was like, she going to park in and eat. Because she was like, I don't like to eat in my car because my car is clean. Her car was clean. So, you could tell she just got a detail. So, she was like, I don't like to drive and eat and, like, fuck my car up. 
So we parked up and we eat and we just getting comfortable. Who finally calling back? Her man. So he finally calling back. So she like, where the fuck you at? Where the fuck? I'm gonna pull up right now. She start the car up. She like, where you at? This nigga ain't even said where he at yet because he on the Bluetooth. So he was like, I'm in the hood, I'm in the hood. Yeah, come pull up or whatever. So she like, I'm gonna pull up, like, why you wasn't answering the phone? And he like, because such and such, this, that, and the third. Like, I was doing this for my grandma. My auntie was painting her her toenails and I had to blow them dry because they ain't got a fan. You know, you, niggas just be saying anything when they lying. So she like, okay, well, I'm gonna pull up. I'm gonna pull up right now. So she was like, I'm still with my homegirl. Cause, oh, cause he asked, he was like, yeah, the homies told me you pulled up to the gas station, or whatever. So she was like, yeah, I pulled up over there or whatever. He was like, yeah, um, such and such told me you was being a, a cock blocker. She's like, man, shut the, like, tell him to shut up. Like, I'll tell you, I'll speak on that later or something like that. So he was like, all right, let's go bowling or something. Like, let's go do something since you with people. So she was like, okay, I'm with my home girl. I'm with my home girl. So he was like, okay, I'm about to tell the homies then. I'm about to tell them. So she was like, all right, we finna pull up. So we on our way up over there. The whole time she texting and driving. I don't like when people text and drive too much. I be looking like, girl, if you swerve this motherfucker one more time, bitch, play with your own life, not mine. So she, in, she texted, she swerving and shit. And like texting him and stuff like that. So we finally pulled up. And I don't know. Maybe she didn't want, she didn't want us to know what she was texting dude. Or I ain't even peeped that she was texting him. Because I'm not all on this girl phone. But I'm thinking like, girl, can you call whoever you texting right now? Or wait till we get to where we going. But yeah, I, w I wasn't putting two and two together that she was texting old boy. But it's going to make sense to why she was texting him and didn't call him. So we ended up pulling up to where he at, right? So when we pulled up, she asked Kiera to get in the back seat. She's like, Kiera, can you get in the back seat? Because I already know he's gonna get in the front because they're gonna ride with us. So I'm kind of thinking, like, damn, how is three ninjas finna fit in this car? Like, this ain't no, this ain't no caravan. <laughs> like, we all can't fit up in here. But I'm just like, we'll figure it out, I guess. So he walked to the car and it's him and the boy Kiera was talking to. So I'm thinking like, damn, my dude already flaking on me. But I ain't, it's not like I text him and tell him we was coming back or whatever like that. So I'm thinking like maybe he in the house like wiping his ass. He probably was just shitting or something like that. And he just getting himself together. You know, so they come outside and they get in the car. Her dude hop in the car or whatever. And she like leaned over for like a kiss to him. And he just like went like this. And he's like, what's up with you? Like he was like, what's up with you, big head? And pushed her head back. And I'm just like, oh, you know how hood, hood, you know how some hood dudes be weird. It's like, how you act like you dish your girlfriend and your homies? Like, you trying to impress him? Let me find out. You got a crush on your friend? But anyway, so, um, Kiara do hop in the car or whatever. So when Kiara do hop in the car, he was like, man, why the fuck you didn't tell me she was still with y'all? Talking about me. So then, um, Nisi do turn around and he was like, wait, you said it was just you and her. Like, just her and Kiara. So she was like, well, I mean, it's not that important. Like, where are we finna go? We finna go to the bowling alley. He was like, man, like, literally talking about the the boy I was talking to. He was like, he literally just pulled off. Like, he was sitting here too, but he pulled off because you said that she went home. Like, you said that she left and it was just y'all two. So, at this point, I'm thinking like, this bitch just got a vendetta out on me. <laughs> What's up with you? So, he was like, yeah, you, told, you said that she left. So, he was like, man, that nigga wasn't finna come with us no way. Like, he be too extra. He be too turned up. I'm not trying to go nowhere with him no way. So she like, where we finna go? Where we finna go? Like, let's just go somewhere. So he was like, dang, all right, I'm gonna call the, like, let's go to where we going and I'm gonna call the homie. So what's it called? The boy Kiera was talking to was like, let's go to the pier. So I don't know why. Like, we're supposed to go bowling. It's not like we was near the pier. I don't know. So he was like, all right. So we ended up pulling up to Santa Monica. So she was like, he was like, I'm gonna call old boy to come up over here. And she was just like, it's not that deep. It's not that serious to call him. So he ended up calling him, but he was like, he's somewhere else. Like he far as fuck. But he was like, when y'all leave from there, hit me. Like, I know the night, the night is young. So y'all could link with me later or whatever like that. So he was like, all right. So y'all, we get out the car and he talking to her. Like he asking her like, why, why you was doing all of that to old boy? He was saying you was getting on his nerves. Like you was acting weird today. So she like, man, I'm not going to talk about that. So she's just like, man, I'm not finna talk about that. Like, she just don't want to talk about it. So we all just laughing, joking. She walking up front with her dude. Me, Kiera, and her dude, we all walk in or whatever. So Kiera dude was one of those dudes. Y'all ever know those dudes? They be like, they talk to, what am I saying? No. They talk to girls, but they be like kind of weird. Like, they like talk shit about you. That's literally what Kiera do. So mind you, Kiera just met this dude today. So we walk in and he was just like, get your dumb ass up there. Like, he talking crazy to her. And I'm just thinking like, oh, I don't like dudes. Them not, those don't, don't. 
I know I be going after some strange people, but they don't be strange in the beginning. Like, I know when I tell these stories, like, I already know they strange. So, of course, I'm going to already be telling y'all that they strange. Like, it ain't going to be no secret and no surprise because I already know the plot. So, I'm already kind of, like, putting it out there. But, like, a lot of times, they be, like, cool in the beginning. I don't go for the dudes that want to shit, shit talk, like, talk shit about you and shit or be weird as fuck for their friend. Like, no, nah, they ain't the kinds I go to because it's like, boy, what the fuck is wrong with you? Like, I, I don't do those. So anyway, he was just so weird. So she like, shut the fuck up. Like, but she smiled. I guess she was loving that shit. So he like, get your dumb ass up there. Like, damn, why the fuck you walking like that? Like, he just talking shit, but trying to be funny as fuck. Like, trying to be so funny. Like, and I was just like, this thing is kind of strange. So, so we end up going up to the line, like, to get the game card. Because we realized you have to have a game card or whatever. So when we went up there, oh boy, Kier, dude, he ended up going. He got a game card or whatever. And then behind him, because I was in line. Behind him, it was Nisi and her dude. And then I was behind them. So what's it called? When they went, he ended up getting two or whatever. So when he got the other one, he handed it to me. No, first he was like, this one ours to Nisi. And he was like, and here you go, Simone. He gave me one. And I was like, oh, no, it's cool. I'm about to buy me one. And he was like, nah, it's cool. Like, you know, um, the homie ain't here to get you one. He was like, so I really don't want you to feel like a real third wheel, you know, third, fifth wheel, because it's four or five of us. But yeah, he's like, I really don't want you to feel like a third wheel. So here, I got you one, whatever. So why Nisi was like, uh-uh, she could have bought her own. Like, she didn't need you to buy her one. So he like... I know she didn't need me to buy her one. Clearly, she said she had been lying. He was like, but the homie ain't here, cuz, so I'm going to buy her. It's like, I'm going to buy hers, because I already know he's talking about his other friend, Barkier one. So the friend's like, no, I didn't. I didn't buy her one. I ain't buy her shit. Like, this one for me. So he like, man, like, stop playing. He laughing. He's like, well, that's for them to share. I already know he got them one. So he's like, no, nah, this for me to play games. He was like, I mean, she could play a game or two with me. And he was dead serious. Mind you, we're laughing, but he dead serious. And he was like, man, bro, like, we, we, you gotta get her one. He was like, bro, you the only one on a date. You the only nigga on a date. <laughs> Mind you, I'm just thinking like, do we know? I don't know, I guess. But it's like, why'd you come? But anyway, so, and I'm like, oh, that's good. We didn't go bowling or something. Cause this boy was not finna pay for Kiara and she ain't got no money on her. So, um, he was like, so they talking. So then, um, Nisi like, well, Kier and Simone could share that one then since he not trying to buy her one. They could just share. So he was like, well, this one for her. If she want to share it with her, like she could. So she's like, no, they could share it. They could share it. Like, you don't have to buy her one. Like, they could share it. So I was like, it's cool. I'm not tripping. Like, I was going to buy my own. Like, I didn't need him to buy me one. So she's like, no, not like that. She's like, not like that. The girl was very much like that. You acting like I was like, please buy me a game card. Please. Like, you make some like I was crying to your man on my knees. Damn near about to sloppy toppy his shit for my game card. Like, why is you being weird to me? No, but for real, she being weird. So when I said that, she's like, oh, no, not like that. Like, not like that. I'm just saying, like, y'all could share. Like, y'all could just share it. And I'm like, okay. So I took it. I'm like, thank you. And Kiera was like, thank you. And we walked off or whatever. So me and Kiera end up going to ice hockey. A boy that she was talking to, he ended up going to like one of them little, little like blicky blicky games. Like, you know, I don't like to say certain stuff on here. But he ended up going to one of them. And then when we at our game, we start playing or whatever. They was over there still talking, Nisi and her dude. But then they end up coming over there by us. So he was like, what y'all playing? <sighs> Are you serious, sir? He acting like me and, me and Kiera is under a cover playing cards and not letting him see like you can see clear as day this ice hockey so i ain't saying nothing i was just playing here was like ice hockey and she just started laughing or whatever and he was like okay i'm gonna have to play one of y'all um afterwards he was like because like okay like i see it i'm gonna play the winner he was like and i think it's gonna be you simone because you you really getting points so i'm just like yeah i'm good at this shit and i start playing so kiera was like you gonna play with me afterwards so he was like, yeah, we could play too. He was like, but I want to play the winner. Like, I want to play somebody competitive. You don't look like you know how to play like that. So she's like, I know how to play ice hockey too. So at this point, I'm just still into my ice hockey game because you're not going to fuck my tournament up with your bad energy. So anyway, we ended up still like playing ice hockey or whatever. And they ended up walking off her to go wherever the fuck they went. Because uh, like I said, I'm focused on this game right here. I ain't got time for nothing else. So we playing or whatever. So next thing you know, old boy the Kier was talking to. He ended up coming over there. And he was like, with your fucked up ass ponytail. Look at y'all. Y'all look stupid as fuck. Y'all just into that damn game. And I'm just thinking like, do we? Like, did I used to like ball up your papers in kindergarten or something? Like, why is you being like, why? what's up with everybody today? I'm just thinking like, this boy is weird. So she like, shut your ass up, stupid with your stupid ass. Something, something. I don't know. She has said something back to him. So he laughing. He just wants somebody he can roast with. And I don't know. I'm just thinking like... 
strange. So anyway, me and her start playing again because she was like, no, nah, you're not finna win me. Like, let's play one more time. Like, uh-uh. So y'all, we playing again. Next thing you know, Nisi and her dude come back over there. So he was like, yeah, I'm gonna have to play. Like, I'm gonna have to play. I'm next. I'm, ne I'm next up in here. I'm next up in here. Yeah, I'm next. Like, I see, I'm next. So Nisi was like, yeah, we gonna play next or whatever. So he was just like, we gonna play too? Damn, like, I just beat your ass in basketball. Like, you not, like, you not athletic. Or I don't know if he said athletic or something. He must have said athletic. But he was like, you, you don't really know how to play like that. Like, it's easy beating you. I want some competition. So she like, well, play with him. Talking about his homeboy. So he was like, I'm up over here. Like, I'm not letting, I'm trying to beat this score or whatever on the little glizzy game. So she like... Well, I'm good. Like, I'm good at this game. I already said I'm good at this game. Like, you don't need what you need to play. Like, what you need to play with her for. So he like, dang, like, you doing too much. He was like, she wouldn't even have to play with me if you wasn't cock blocking um, and let the homie come or whatever. So she was just like, you doing too much. Like, you doing, like, telling him he doing too much or whatever. So after our game, like, while they still talk, our game ended and I left. Because I'm not about to be like, okay, okay, Nisi nigga, you up next. <laughs> like, I ain't finna do all that. So I ended up, we take our thing. And I was like, what you want to play now? So she was like, she finna play with, oh boy, he was, she was talking to because he was like, he asked her, like, did she want to play? So I'm like, all right, I'm finna go play something by myself or whatever. So I ended up going to like the little cars or whatever. So next thing you know, well, I'm playing a little race car and Nisi and them come up over there. Like they all walk up over there and Nisi was like, I'm ready to go. You ready to go, Simone? And I'm thinking like, what happened that quick? Like what happened that quick? Mind you, I probably played the race car probably like twice. But you know that shit go by fast because I'm by myself. So I'm like, mm, I'm going to just stick right here. This cool because I could go play like basketball stuff. It was a lot of people there too that day. So, I mean, the two people games, it was like, you kind of get in where you fit in. So I'm thinking like, what happened that fast? So she was like, yeah, you ready to go? We ready. We about to go. So I was like, all right. So he like, let her finish her game. So she was like, I'm about to be in the car. And she walked off. And she was like, come on. Like to him, like, come on. So Kiera ended up staying right there. And he stood there too. They all stayed there. She walked off and went to the car. And I'm thinking like, oh, let me just get up off this game. Because she all right. And she not going to leave us in Santa Monica. So anyway, I was almost done anyway. So I ended up finishing. We all walked off. So he was like, yeah, we about to pull up to the hood. Like, you finna see the homie again. Like, we finna go pull up. We finna go do some other stuff. Like, y'all drink, y'all smoke with y'all on. Like, we could probably get something to eat or whatever. Just chill or whatever. So I'm like, yeah, I'm not tripping. I'm trying to keep it real casual and small with him because I see that she clearly don't want this dude talking to me. And she kind of being weird about it. Like, she making it seem like if I start stroking her man head when he hopped in the car, I'm just like, oh, I love your waves. Like, she acting weird. Like, she acting as if I'm on this dude and I'm like barely talking to him. So we end up getting in the car. So he like, um, she like, what you finna do? He's like, we finna pull up to the hood. Like, the night's still young. We finna pull up to the hood or whatever. So she's like, all right. So we end up pulling up to the hood or whatever. Mind you, he was trying to talk to her. She kept cutting that music up loud as fuck. We end up pulling up to... I'm like, that's just her thing when she mad. <laughs> we end up pulling up to the hood. And him and the old boy end up getting out the car. So he like, hold on real quick. Like, I'm about to see if we finna be right here or we finna move. But hold on real quick. So he end up getting out the car. It's a lot of people outside and shit. And we sit in the car. We talking or whatever. So she was just like, he be getting on my nerves. Like, he be getting on my nerves. Like, he really fuck with me though. Like, don't get it twisted. Like, he fuck with me. Mind you, I'm not saying nothing because her and these, her and Kiera was already having a conversation. So I'm assuming that's who she was talking to. Because I'm like, this bitch kind of being weird. Like, I'm feeling your energy and I see you still a weird bitch. So, mm. Yeah, so she just talking. I'm not really saying nothing. So when she said, like, he really fuck with me, she just saying it. And Kira's like, yeah, I see. Like, I could tell. Like, I heard about him too, girl. Like, he got money to keep him around. Da, 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 da. So she was like, you heard me? So Kira was like, yeah, girl. Like, you know, because she just responded to her. She's like, oh, no, I was talking to Simone. Like, you quiet back there with you sleep or something? So I was like, oh, no, I'm just on my phone. So she's like, yeah, like I was saying, I've been talking to him for a cool minute. Like, he really fuck with me. I heard you first time so i'm just like oh yeah that's real cool like that's cool i'm like but why you said because now i'm gonna bring it up again so i'm like but why you say you don't want me talking to his friend she was just like oh no i'm just saying because like you know how these how these ninjas be like i be seeing him like i seen him um with girls in his car before but yeah so i asked her like yeah so she like i seen different girls in his car before like i be seeing him pull up with different girls like he always got a different girl in the car with him so she's like yeah so no like mm -mm. so then i'm like oh i'm like okay <laughs> like my thing is i'm not trying to marry dude like i'm on and off with crazy i'm talking to this one dude which i don't remember what i named him but like remember the story time y'all where i had said i had linked with the boy and i had talked to him back in the day and um i had left my bathing suit at the house and it was in like the the poly mailer that had my address on there or whatever and i was like and a girl ended up hitting me up yeah him i don't remember what i named him though but he do come back up though and the only reason why i'm mentioning him is because it has something to do with like some with these people too so anyway 
but he not in his story, so it don't matter. So anyway, so yeah, so I'm not really tripping about this boy. Like, I'm not trying to marry the boy or nothing like that. Like, you say he ain't got no girlfriend, you'll see what I'm saying, girl, every day. So, girl, I ain't really tripping. Like I said, like, it's not that deep. We young, we single, everybody doing them, like, not that serious. Like, excuse me, it's not like I went over there and was like, I want to marry you and got on my knee and was like, please. I'm just here, let me stop. But she makes it like I'm begging niggas out here. And it's like, girl, what the fuck? Y'all nigga be with everybody too. I be seeing him. Like, the boy she was talking to, like, he was very well known. And I used to see a lot of girls post him all the time. So, it was already kind of a shocker when she was saying this was her dude and he really fucked with her. But I guess. So... I'm just like, oh, okay. So then she was like, yeah, but she was talking about her dude again. She was like, yeah, but he really want me. Like, he really be wanting me, wanting me. She was like, but I'm not trying to have just one nigga right now. Like, I got my options. And she was just like, and plus, he be wanting me to be his baby mama. Like, and I just laughed because I don't know. It was funny to me because it was like dudes saying, I want you to be my baby mama is kind of weird. Like, that's it. <laughs> Nothing else. Like, you want me to be your wife, like, your, your girl. Like, you just want me to have a child with you. Like, that's it <laughs> so i just was thinking like and she was like what's funny so i'm like niggas is funny like that's what's funny so she's like how like i don't like what was funny about that i'm like him saying he wants you to be his baby mama my like, niggas be thinking like that's i ain't say flex but i'm like i forgot the word i use but i'm like niggas be thinking that's a like a turn on like it's not like if you're not trying to be my man but you say i want you to have my kid like it's nothing turned on about that like i swear to god it's not and the girls that be bragging like he wanted me those be saying anything just so they ain't got to pull out and they don't be thinking about the responsibility of it all and then when you get pregnant and they be mad they be thinking it's like your issue when it's like boy why the f did you do like it's just so weird like i'm like i don't get boy mad but it be strange as hell because i swear they don't be wanting to pull out and then they cry when you get pregnant and you want to keep it. Like, it's so crazy to me. But I didn't explain all of this shit because she probably would have thought I was a hater. So anyway, where we talking or whatever, he ended up coming back to the car. And he was just like, yo, dude, like, yo, ninja here. Yo, ninja here talking to me. He was like, get out the car. Like, come get out the car. Like, yo, ninja here. So I'm like, all right, I'm about to get out. So I'm like, y'all get out with me. Y'all get out. So she's like, all right, we all finna get out the car. So we get out the car or whatever. And he was just like, what's up? Like, what's up? Girl, I forgot what he said in exact words. He's like, what's up? So we talking to her and ever, and she just being weird, like weird. So she was just like, why your ass still trying to talk to her after I told you not to talk to her? So her dude was like, Nisi, stop with that shit. Like, don't do that shit, cuz. Like, stop with that shit now. So she was just like, I'm just saying. So he like pulled her over to the side. So me and him, we just chopping it up or whatever like that. So... He was like, so what she said about me? Like, what she said? Why she said she didn't want me talking to you? So I was like, she didn't say nothing bad about you. And he was like, no, for real, tell me. He was like, because I want to know too, because why she acting like that? He was like, she don't never act like that. She be trying to put me on the, all her homegirls. He was like, but all of a sudden, she don't want me to talk to you. Like, like I don't get it. So I was like, mm. So then I started putting two and five together. I'm like, oh, maybe she want him to talk to one of her other friends. And not me i'm not your friend anyway so mm. so he was just like yeah he was like but nah like i don't i want to talk to you so then i was like okay like whatever sure so we just talking or whatever and me him kier and kier dude is on a circle kier dude talking shit about kier for some odd reason and they just going back and forth he was like that nigga a fool like he be doing stupid shit so we just all talking laughing or whatever so they end up coming back over there we all having like a cool conversation so we up over there we just chilling and stuff it's probably like an hour and shit went by so afterwards she like all right um I'm finna drop y'all off because, um, like, she about to go lay up with dude. Like, he was trying to go get a room with her or whatever like that. So, she's like, all right, well, we finna go. Like, all right, bye. Like, we finna leave. So, he was like, I'm not done. Like, I want to still talk to her. Like, oh, boy was saying he still wants to talk to me. So, she was like, well, you end up getting her number anyway, so you'll call her or whatever. So, he's like, nah, I'm gonna take her home. He's like, if it's cool with you, like, can I take you home? So, I'm like, oh, in my head, I'm here, proud family. Can I take you home, ponytail? So, that's what I'm here. So, I'm like, yes, you could. What was his name? I was gonna say Lil Murder. when he was like can i take you home if that's cool with you i was like yeah you can take me home <laughs> you can take me home i'm just kidding y'all like i said crazy who at this point me and crazy was not talking <laughs> y'all already know when me and him break up and or go through our like two-day breakup or whatever or like whatever he be but dealing with whoever he dealing with so he be out of sight out of mind but this is what make him hit me up because like if we break up and we not talking and i'm not blowing his phone up or trying to text him because he like not reply anyway so if i'm not trying to like get in contact with him then that's when his mind starts wondering like hmm she must be in contact with someone else and that's when he try to hit me up like who you been talking to who this and he'd be like boy worry about what you was doing for the for this time being don't worry about me so anyway like i said i wasn't worried about him
like I wasn't I wasn't worried. So yeah, um, I was like, yeah, you can take me home. So she's like, uh-uh, no, they came together. I'ma just take them home. Like they going to the same spot. So Kier was like, I'm not tripping or whatever. Cause the old boy she was dealing with, he was like, well, if that's the case, then you wanna come to my house? And she was, Kier was like, boy, I'm not trying to go to your house. So he was like, all right then, whatever. Like, fuck you then. <laughs> so she was like, yeah, no, come on. They finna go, like, come on, Simone. Like, we finna go, like, come on. So I was like, no, nah, it's cool. He could take me home or whatever. So she's like, Simone, you don't need to be over here like this late. Like, nah, come on. Come on, Simone. <laughs> come on. So I'm like, it's cool. So he's like, we not even finna be over here. We finna go get us something to eat and we finna leave. Like, we not finna... We not finna stay up over here. No way. I'm not finna have her in the hood. Like, I want some one-on-one -on -one time with her. And I'm just thinking, like, boy, don't think you finna hit. Because you not. <laughs> but anyway, so, um, yeah. So, she like, no, Simone, come with us. Like, come on. So, Kira was like, it's cool. Like, I'm good. Like, I'm good. Go ahead. Like, I'm good. So, I was like, all right, I'm gonna hit you when I get home. So, I start walking with him. So, Nisi like, what the fuck? No, like, tell her to come on. Like, tell her. So, her her boo like, man, come on. Like, hurry the fuck up for you. Irritate me. <laughs> like, let's just go. She good. She with the homie. Like, she in good hands. So, they ended up leaving or whatever. And um, Kira ended up texting me when she got to where she was going. She was asking me if I was good or whatever. Me and him, guess where we went? Bossa Nova. <laughs> no, but me and him, we went to Bossa Nova or whatever. Because he was asking me what I wanted to eat. And I was like... He asked me what my like what I like to eat. And I like Mexican food and pasta and soul food. And you know, it's only two out of those three places that you could really go to and eat for real from LA. And I said we ain't got good soul food. I'm not saying that, but I'm not saying we do neither. We do sometimes, but not at that time of the night. Sometimes. Anyway, so yeah, we he was like, You wanna go to Bossa Nova? Y'all know that was every hood nigga classic. Like every hood nigga Bossa Nova. So I was like, Yeah, we go to Bossa Nova. So she ended up asking me if I was cool and I was like, You good? She was I'm like, you at home or whatever? Cause I was gonna have him I was thinking about it, like, oh maybe I could have him drop me off at her house so I could just spend the night. But she ended up going to that dude house that was cussing her out and talking shit about her all day. I don't know why she used to do shit like that. Like she'd play in front of people like, what the fuck? But they'd tell me like, girl, why? And it's like, I don't know why you play like that in front of me if you're gonna turn around and tell me you did it. So anyway, she ended up going to his house and um I guess Nisi went with her dude or whatever like that. So yeah, me and him went to Boston Nova and he took me home. That was about it. It was nothing like he he didn't try to do one two. I guess he was kind of trying to test my temperature or whatever, like see what was up. But like it was never no one two or whatever. It was like a real um short lived situation. But yeah, it was cool for the time being. But yeah, that was it, and that was not the last of Nisi at all. The bitch was a weirdo. But that was not the last of her. And the reason why she didn't want me talking to him, I have no clue. I don't know. Y'all know, like, he was, like, one of them. And he was really, like, out there, like, getting money and shit like that. So, maybe that's why she probably had him on her list next. Like, so she probably was like, bitch, no. But, um, other shit kind of added up. I don't know why I would link with these people again. I mean, not these people, but with Nisi. But, yeah, that wasn't the end of, the, the end of this. The end of that girl. But, um... That's it for this story time. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Don't forget, it is 14 days of love. I don't know why I'm saying that as if I'm posting 14 days. Only place I'm posting for 14 days straight is on my Brashari page. So make sure y'all go ahead and follow up because we dropping on Valentine's Day our new collection, the white one, and we restocking on that pink that y'all love. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'll see y'all next time.